My greatest fear is to be petrified, to become a tree, to put out roots and be unable to move. Rosie Bradotti's words coat my tongue so often they taste like my own. I am an army brat, postmodern nomad, and I have no home, won't claim no home, refuse to be at home. I am a child of movement. But before all the moves disoriented me physically and theory decentered me intellectually, I had a kind of, sort of, once upon a time home. Why didn't you tell me it was so beautiful? I asked my dad as we drove into the Mojave Desert for the first time. We just come from Germany, from elegant castles, an ancient forest, the Rhine River, and I am in awe over a couple of painted rocks and a whole lot of nothing. My parents don't even try to hide their amusement, and I know right then, I love you, California. I love the middle of nowhere. In front of our house is a garden of cactus and rocks. In the backyard, there's a little patch of grass, but who cares about that? We have a whole yard of natural chalk that I use to scratch out my dreams on the driveway. You taught me how to leave a little bit of myself behind. I love you, California. I love the excitement and refreshment of a water fight in the afternoon. On days so hot, the news tells us to stay inside. I taunt the temperature in my swimsuit, ready to fight my neighbors. And sure, they think they're cool with their super soakers 3000s, but who needs water guns when you have a hose? I race backwards, dragging my surprise weapon, ready to attack when I step on a cactus. You taught me the biggest fight was with myself. I love you, California. I love birthdays at Disneyland, ending up at Mr. Toad's Wild Ride. I'm the biggest, so I get to drive. I watch as the cars in front of me head towards heaven and hell. I am ready to follow the path of light, but no matter how many I steer the steering wheel, we are only going to hell. And boy, did my parents give me hell. They started teasing me about my driving and never learned how to stop. Their teasing taught me to grow tough skin for tough love, tough love for tough pain. I love you, California. I love the signposts at Death Valley. Warning, in case of inclement weather, leave immediately. Flash flooding may occur. And the overcast skies have me worried, but I keep hiking past the first drop that splashes in front of me, past the second drop that hits my left shoulder, past the third drop that wets my nose, and I stop. These drops plus those clouds equal inclement weather, and I know we have to turn back, but my parents keep walking, and it keeps raining, and I am suddenly alone, alone in inclement weather, alone when a flash flood could occur at any moment, and in the next moment, Mom and Dad come around the corner yelling, the water is coming! And I turn, and I sprint, and I know running full well that the racing wall of water is right behind me and it's gonna get me at any second. Their laughter taught me the pleasures and consequences of believing everything I hear. I love you, California, my kind of, sort of, once upon a time home. Why didn't you tell me it was so beautiful?